Hey guys, Lee H here, aka Criterium Racer, and I just got a little bit of pickups this week. I've been too busy doing other stuff, um, bike racing, to really um, focus on my car collecting. Hopefully in two weeks I can um, start collecting uh, and looking for stuff. This is out of 99. We got Eddie Matthews to go back with Eddie Matthews. And on that um, Braves Fence Buster cards is one of my favorite cards. I got... Uh, Del Crandall's on there. There's an autograph of him and Joe Adcock, too. So that's a nice little feature. Still don't have a Hank Aaron autograph. Well, I did a TTM when I was a little boy, and it's probably sitting in my parents' attic at my, um, uh, my, uh, what do you call it? My Hank Aaron, you know, TTM. We got a couple Goonies art cards out of 50. Uh, I don't think I had these. These are like a buck a piece. Um, I also hadn't bought a new box of cards in a while, so I picked up um, these bad boys, uh, official Hollywood cards. It's fun to, you know, kind of go through. Look at how young Stallone looks back there. But the big P uh, chase card is going to be the Pee Wee, but that's going to be a nice little addition to my collection there. So off camera, I'm going to open this up because I'm working with a limited space. I got something from Bud Stoney here, and it's probably a pack of non-sport cars. Let's kind of get into these um, suckers here. Maybe open a couple packs with you here. Whoop! Knock the camera per usual, and let's little gander here. Hope everyone's having a great week here. Okay. Ooh, I like these cards. He may have just sent this as long as an extra here. Uh, Pop Century is one of my favorite um, sets. Just to reminisce about some great music cards. And I'm probably going to end up giving these away at my store. Because I like to get people interested in non-sport cards. We got a share card and another share card. I need to pick up her autograph. It's harder than you think. Uh, Bobby Brown, my prerogative. Uh, some DJ from back in the day, Simple Minds, always known for the Pretty in Pink soundtrack. Gotta love the Who, Bruce Hornsby. I sung him a couple years ago. I was uh, a little disappointed with that show, but it was a free show. So what are you gonna do? Lionel Richie, Young MC. We're gonna bust a move. <laughs> Ario Speedwagon. Oh, Hall and Oates. These guys are hating each other, fight, fighting over rights and everything like that. <laughs> Gotta love that mustache, though. And I'll be honest, I have those aviators. <laughs> oh, Doro. The Smithereens. Violins. Dangerous toys. Sweet. Oh, we got a little bit of extreme sports. What we're looking for is the Chad Otterstrom. He, I see him bike by my work every single day. Let's see if we can pull him. We got John Kelly. We got Bob. Hans Ray. I've actually mountain biked with him on Slick Rock in Moab, Utah, back when I was in high school. So that was a long time ago. That guy could, he literally rode circles around me on his front wheel. We got Dave. Which, who's that? I don't know who he is. Scott. Uh, Scott Kenvitt. I don't know him. Just seeing if the skiers, because I, I live in a ski town. See if I know any of these guys. Brian Lopes, that's probably... Oh, Forrester. I'm just striking out on these. <clears throat> Todd Richards, he's pretty famous. Matt. Goodwill. Miles on the Vol um, Volvo Cannondale team. I've met him a few times. We got Jim. Jim Scott. And I'm striking out on some of those. We got some. Holy shnikes. Look at that mess behind you. I'm going down in flames. <laughs> 